Okay, so uh, it's hump day, it's Wednesday after uh, kickoff last Saturday. So we're in the middle of, right in the smack dab in the middle of week one of Destination Deep Space, sponsored by Boeing. Wrong. The kickoff of Deep Space, Des Destination Deep Space. Cut. Of Destination Deep Space, presented by the Boeing Corporation. Wrong. The 2019 Destination Deep Space, presented by the Boeing Company. Yeah. One of the differences that we saw in the robot rules was some changes in the in the car, or the B, what I used to call the BOM, but the CAW. And I think they just came out with an update last night. Are they going to come out with updates on every Tuesday? Is that typical? Historically, it's been Tuesdays? Tuesdays and, and Fridays. Fridays. Yeah. And then they slow down to just like Tuesdays after bag day, right? Yeah. Right. yeah. To not affect events. Yeah. So Tuesday update from this week showed us they changed so a few things, but they showed us they changed the overall cap of the CAW to be increased by $500. So it already went up from 4000 to 5000 and now it went from 5000 to 500 because they're reallocating some of the some of how we account for some of the parts in our CAW. It's more restrictive now, and that's one of the reasons why they raised the, the they price. They did say it was an apology. The extra 500 was an apology for not telling us sooner because some teams made financial decisions ahead of time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Also in the update, they did clarify some of the changes in the have dimensions in the, in the manual. Actually, that, that kind of impacts me right now because I, my job on our team is I'm building our field elements. Me and I had one student help me last night. He was pretty good. He was a freshman. So check out the dimensional changes in the update for the HAB especially. One of the things that we're, we're getting a few people asking us about, and Ruth is going to put out some social media polls about this, but people are asking us where they can find orange peel HTPE. So pay attention to our social media. If you think that's something that we should sell as sheet plastic of HTPE, let us know because we're thinking about doing that. We're not shipping 8x4 sheets, I'll tell you that right now. We're not shipping 4x4 <laughs> sheets. I think we can deal with a 2 foot by 4 foot sheet of probably the thinnest HDPE with orange peel finish we can get. And then you can put it on top of plywood as you wish. Let us know. Leave a comment below. Yeah. We'll have a Twitter poll. We'll have a chief poll. We'll also probably have a poll on Facebook. Respond in all three if you really, really want it. Respond in all three if you really don't want it. Respond anyways. It is Pizza Wednesday. This is Mancino's Pizza. It is my favorite pizza today. Danny has chicken. I've got sausages, pepperoni. Liz has chicken and bacon. Nick has some napkins. So our next topic really is um, Roman in three days videos. <laughs> Okay, so I saw a pretty cool video <laughs> yesterday. Robot in three days, Florida did a robot in one day, or essentially 24 hours. Mm -hmm. I think they just worked, they just they just pushed through 24 hours and built a robot. Those guys are amazing. So kudos to you guys in Florida for making a robot. Your video is impressive. They they're the pros. They set the standard. They have a really nice robot. They have a really nice pr uh, production video. They used a Raptor track drive from us to get up on level two of the HAB, and that seemed to work pretty well. They had to make sure their center of gravity was right as they went up, but that seemed to work really well. Yeah, they played with a couple of conf configurations in the video of their elevator at different heights um, as they were trying to get on level two by just playing with that center of gravity. I like their beak, with yeah. their well, Demi Gorgon, right, from Stranger yeah. Things, their beak thingy to pick up the, the hatches. Brett could link their video into this video, maybe some of their some of their highlights, maybe? The one thing about the uh, RA3 to 1.0 robot that used the Raptor track drive is uh, a lot of people are saying it looked like it was driving really slow. And that's because it appears that the 1.0 guys reused the Evo shifters that were donated to that team a few years ago, which the ratios were optimized for six inch wheels. The diameter of the pulleys being a lot smaller uh, than six inch wheels, it looks like it drives slow. And plus it looked like it was also in low gear the entire time, which by some napkin math is probably in that two to three feet per second range. It will go fast. We've seen Raptor going fast on our carpet out here. Yeah. Maybe that's a challenge to us to get a Raptor video going that could really be fast. But I think it's not hard to do that. It's just a gearing thing. So we have a flyer here that was in everybody's kits and we hope you check this out. An interesting thing that you might check out would be week one, week two, all the way to week six, 
um, promoted items on this flyer. All of the codes will be going out this Friday, but we will also announce the upcoming build season release codes on, in Friday's newsletter and on Friday's lunch with Starting this Saturday and every Saturday after, there will be a new code, and that code is only good for that week. For that week. Oh, can we call them launch codes? Yeah, that. Done. Uh, ship two. Ship it. Yeah, ship four. I should be in marketing. So we're going to have these codes. Maybe they're called launch codes that coincide with the promoted items for that week. At the end of this week, we're going to have codes that you can put in and get a, get yourself a discount that's going to impact your buy. It's going to be a 5% discount. It'll help you out on 5% of the cost that we have here. So we're trying to pr promote certain items for certain weeks that helps you get ready and build your robot through the season. Like for instance, week five, we're doing bumper items because that's about the time when you start working on your bumpers. And there's a lot happening on social media with us. These folks are doing a lot of work to get information out there. Check us out on Twitter. YouTube channel has a lot of videos on there. Follow us on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, all those things, Instagram and Twitch. We have a Twitch show tomorrow night at seven o'clock. We have a Twitch show tomorrow night at 6 o'clock, so you can check us out and see what we're talking about live on Twitch. Also, check check out some of our, our new sale prices. Go to the top left side of the portion of the webpage and look for the, the sale items. You might find some bargains that you were not expecting. Keep building. Keep concepting. Hopefully your team is working on your overall robot concept this week. This week, and you need to start think, having something that drives or having something that's close to driving. And you should have an overall concept of your robot pretty soon. We'll see you on Friday. We have work to do, orders to pack, and people to take care of. So have a great, safe week, and we'll see you Friday. What? Is that a is that a baker's dozen? That is a baker's uh, dozen. Uh, Damn it! Got him! <laughs>